In this question, the principle states that offer and acceptance are two most essential elements of a valid agreement and the offer and acceptance must be absolute and without any scope of doubt. As per the facts, A offered to sell his white horse to B for a consideration of 1 lakh, B agreed to purchase the horse but for a consideration of 75,000 only. A duly received the acceptance from B but refused to communicate any further. So the acceptance over here was ambiguous because he received the acceptance from B but did not communicate any further. So the, absent, uh, the acceptance is not clear, it's not absolute and has a lot of scope for doubt. Therefore, if you look at the four options, first option say that a, a valid and enforceable agreement has been concluded, which is not correct. D says acceptance conveyed by B was absolute and ambiguous, not correct. C says offer made by A was not complete. The and option B says that no agreement has been concluded between A and B. So offer was complete over here but acceptance was not complete. Therefore C would not be the answer. Hence the correct answer option would be option B.